All right. Hey, uh, congratulations. First of all, is it Sam or Samuel? And then just how would you describe your uh, your style of play? Um, my full name is Samuel, but you can call me Sam. Uh, and I'm a lockdown press corner in your face. I also, but I also am good at off. I'm a man corner overall. Um, I, I, I improved in my zone, so I, I got better in my zone to uh, fulfill my all around coverage. Um, and I and I, I'm physical too. I like to get hands on. I like to tackle. I like to do it all. Congratulations, Sam. I just wanted to know how much contact did you have with the 49ers during this process of any and how familiar you are how familiar are you with the 49ers defense? Hey, I have some uh contact with the DB coach, the zone call with the DB coach. Uh, I met the GM Lynch at a bowl game. Uh, and I just talked to scouts. There's a few scouts at my pro day and I when I did good there. Uh, and you know, scouts were just calling me here and there throughout the weeks. Um and I'm familiar, I'm familiar with their defense. They run a kind of similar defense to what I ran in college in terms of being playing man, cover three, switching it up to cover four. So that's similar to what I did in high school. I mean, in college. Hey, Sam, I saw you were a walk on. Um, is that because college has totally missed on you, or, or was it because you just improved a lot uh, when you got to Toledo? Uh, it was both. Um, out of high school, I for sure should have had offers, but I played a role in that too because I, I was playing basketball too. So I didn't really know which sport I wanted to do. I chose like didn't really go to camps and get that exposure like kids do nowadays. So that was kind of me. But my my tape was good, so you know a lot of colleges for sure missed out on the dogs. Um, <laughs> so and what, what was your uh, your last second question? You answered it. You answered okay. it. Thank you. Samuel, congratulations. Uh, have the 49ers talked to you about where you might be playing on the defense? And then also, how has this process been for you? What was today getting the call like? Um, yeah, we talked about playing uh, majority inside as well as playing special teams and then on the defense playing majority inside. Uh, and, but I have the versatility to play outside, and we talked about that also. Um, and you know, this journey and this road that I've been on and getting to this moment, it just it just was so surreal. Really couldn't believe it. When I got that call, I knew the area code, so I knew what team it was coming from when I got the call. Um, and it was just so surreal. And then once I see my name on that board, just seeing my family just light up right with me, it was just – it was an amazing moment that I just can't take away. Hey, Samuel, congratulations. Uh, you mentioned playing inside the 49ers this past year. A lot of their biggest plays on defense were blitzes from the slot cornerback that, that hit. How, how much experience do you have blitzing? And if you do have some experience blitzing, uh, do you enjoy that facet of the game? I have a lot of experience blitzing, uh, and a lot of reps, whether it's in practice or in game. I have a lot of reps at that, and I, I like it. I mean, I feel like when I come off on that edge that I'm, I can use my feet, my speed, and I'm so faster than the lineman trying to get his hands on me real quick. Uh, I feel like I can get to that quarterback quick when I'm blitzing or just make a play back there because I'm so fast. You can correct me if I'm wrong, but but didn't you, you and Ambry Thomas used to be high school rivals and, and you had a pretty big <laughs> game against his team about six years ago? Uh, uh, yeah, I don't like his school, but you know, me and him, me and him got a great relationship. That's my, that's my mask. That's my brother. Uh, me and him worked out a couple of times and, you know, ch top chopped it up a couple of times. So I'm familiar with him. Uh, when I played against him in high school, like we played them at least twice a year. So rather it's the playoffs and regular season. So, uh, I mean, they got the best, of, they got the best of us, but I feel like in our matchup, me and me versus him, I got the best of him. Every time. Say that again. Have you spoken to Ambry Thomas recently? Uh, I haven't talked to him since about the summer. 
or in medical during the season, you know, I just talked to him and just congratulated him on how he finished the season, especially when he got that pick against the Rams. And just congratulated him and just told him how he working hard. And, you know, he just said, you go get here to this, you go get to this day, you go get to this level. It's just ironic that we're just on the same team now. Go ahead, Jen, last one. Uh, are there any cornerbacks in particular that you watch in the NFL that you like to model your game after? Um, I don't really model my game after nobody specifically. I watch the different corners, whether they legends that or Hall of Famers that already play or the new ones like Jalen Ramsey and, and players like that. And I just take bits and pieces and learn from what, the, the, what they saying and the knowledge that they're giving out. And I just try to add it to my game to, to bring it to all at one. All right. Well, thank you, Sam. We appreciate it. Congrats again. Uh, thank you. We'll talk soon. Yes, sir.